Hello friends, in this video we are going to see about how to fix mobile charging problem. A Android, a Microsoft Mo Android mobile is this. So in this mobile when we charge the mobile, the output of the mobile will be shown. And that is the battery voltage will be shown in the output. But here the complaint is the battery voltage is not shown here and so the mobile is not getting charged. So this is the issue. So let's see how to solve this. First you should check the whether the battery is good and the charger is also good or not. So this is the connector and check whether the connectors are also good or not. There are no complaints even though if you have any doubts you can check it with the output pin of the charger. I am going to check it by using the multimeter. So the battery voltage is shown so the battery voltage of the mobile is low that is why the issue is here i'm checking in the battery connector the connections comes from the main connections in the motherboard i'm going to check by using the track lines so i'm checking all the components nearby so here the voltage is 3.7 voltage of the battery so now we'll check the battery connector in the track lines so I'm checking all the components nearby. I'm checking it manually. You can also use schematic diagrams. From this connector, we should check the battery connector. So only it will charge. You can use schematic diagram or else you can you do it all manually also. Sometimes if the battery connector is wrong, the battery will be wrong. So we'll check the components separately and manually. So I'm going to check it each and every components manually. So the capacitors here is mainly here for the filter functions. So the connections comes from the main connections so i'm the i'm going to check the by using the tracking lines so here the connections are here in the resistors and the components nearby as i said before the capacitor capacitor is mainly here for the filter functions so i'm checking it and the lines are coming so I didn't get the continuity here. If the track line is good, I can connect it directly to the battery connector and will do jumpering process. So let's see how to jumper it. So from one point to the other point, I have jumpered it and I have fixed it. So if there is any insulations for the other components, there is no problem. Do soldering where you want to jumper. So I'm going to check now. I'm checking the track lines first again. So I'm doing the jumpering process by using this strip. So now I have done the jumpering process.
so i have i'm holding the battery with my hand so let's check it whether it's charging or not so yes it shows the charging indication symbol so now it's charging it's done so this is the process for fixing the mobile charging problem so friends hope you all have enjoyed this video like share and comment to our channel and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press on the bell button thank you for watching